Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 4th of October 2024. I hope you are keeping well. It's a topsy-turvy day for me in terms of Sudoku. The Guardian is the last one getting played, uh, where it's normally the first one in the morning when I wake up. Uh, reason for that is it wasn't available before I went out to work. I'm back from work now and it is here. It's finally arrived. I've no idea what time it got here, but anyway, definitely late. Slow Sudoku to arrive. Uh, as you can probably hear in the background, rain. It's raining here. Um, not quite as heavy as it was before. I've, I, I couldn't <coughs> get started at, uh, about 10 or 15 minutes ago, but it seems to have eased off. So I think it shouldn't be too noisy uh, for you. What's going on in the world? We know that the carbon offsetting game is a bit of a dodgy one anyway. Uh, and apparently a former uh, executive of a, a carbon offsetting company, Kenneth Newcomb of uh, Sequest Capital, has been indicted with fraud. Uh, in, indicted for fraud, I should say, uh, with prosecutors alle alleging that he is part of a scheme to make... Um, Credit, carbon credits appear more successful at reducing emissions than they actually were. Isn't this nasty? I mean, you know, we're, we're in enough trouble already. Um, but <laughs> let's not try to uh, cheat the planet, uh, you know, out of any last hope. <laughs> of course, carbon, as I said, carbon credit uh, offsetting is a bit of a dodgy game anyway. We're not really sure that it has the benefits that its uh, promoters hope that it has, uh, say that it has, but anyway. Uh, anything is better than nothing in these times, I suppose. Uh, of course, what we really need to do is stop the emissions rather than try to use uh, offsetting. Big companies just uh, use it as an excuse to continue polluting. Right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku then. So it's the Guardian's hard level puzzle. I can see a couple of things already. I can see the fours blocking like this, which will give me fours in those two squares, blocking to the bottom and forward blocking down here. It gives me a four. Four blocking across here and a four there. Fours moving across here will say, hey, buddy, be a four for me. And uh, I noticed something else as well. Fives block across here and across here and up here. So there's a five. And we've got fives going up to the top here like this and across there. So there's a five. Uh, five across here, across here and up and up so we'll get another five there <coughs> five down here down here across here and across there fives are out of the way we can forget them until the next sudoku puzzle seven blocks across here and across here and down there so we'll get seven in that square seven coming down here and down there so there's another seven we can have seven across this way this way and up there if i can just extend the blue line a little bit the thin blue line or the thick blue line in this case oh i hear the sound of thunder we have nine blocking this square nine blocking this square and nine blocking this square so in that row there's our nine Missing numbers across here, I believe, are 1, 2, and 8. Let me just double check. I think that's right. Okay, 2 and 8 are in the same column. That then will be our 1. So I believe we're looking for 6 and 9 in this column here. 6 blocks that square there. So 6 goes there, and a 9 will be here. 9 also blocks up there and across there. Missing numbers in these three squares are 2, 3 and 4. 2 and 4 in the same column. That will be our 3. 3 blocks across here and across there giving us 3 in that square. 
three blocking down here and across there there's another three three across here across there and down there means that that's a three What's missing from here? Two and four. So what are we left with here? Oh, it's got to be that one and eight, isn't it? One, eight, one, eight. Yeah, yeah. Six blocking up here and six across here will give me six in that square. Six blocking down here and down here says that's a six. Six across here and six down there says this is a six. We've got one eight in these squares and those squares up there. Two blocks down here and across there, so there's our two. <coughs> seven blocks down here, there's a seven. Seven across here and down and down. Seven is finished. Five and seven are both finished. And now we've got one eight here. So we've got one eight, 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 like that in those blue squares. Ah, if this is one and eight, at least this is one and eight, at least we can get this up here, can't we? That's got to be a three. So three blocking up here and across, across and up there. Says Three is now finished. So it's these one eights that are the problem. We get one of them, the rest of them will probably fall pretty quickly. Also one and eight in this row here. Really a lot of one and eights. Let's see. <clears throat> six bl blocks up here like this and six blocks across here and across there so that'll be a six and six blocking up here up here and across there finishes the sixes Nine up here and across here now then there's the nine and nine down here and there and across there it says nine is here still looking for those ah okay great I've got it no hang on a second no maybe not maybe not 
Yes, I have. Eight blocks across here, so it says eight is in one of these two squares. So finally we know this square cannot be eight. So that's going to be eight. This is going to be one. This is going to be eight. That's going to be a one. That's going to be eight. And this is going to be a one. And the last digit to place over here is one. And one blocks up here and up here and across there, giving me the one there and the eight at this end. And the eight blocking down says this is an eight. We have eight across here and across there. There's our eight. This time over here, we're looking for a two, I think it is. <coughs> and up here, a one. One blocks this square, there's our one. The last number to place here is four. One more number here. No, it's not a six. Uh, is it an eight? I think it is. Okay, an eight down here gives me the eight in that square. The last number here is two. Two blocking up here. You're a two, two across there. There's a two. Last number here is a four. Still need a four in this block here. Four blocks up there. There's a four. Two finishes the game. That's our Guardian's hard level puzzle for a Friday. The weekend is almost here. Ah, it's, I think it sounds like the rain has stopped. But uh, let's hope it's not like it's been the last few days and starts again in the middle of the night and wakes me up. Anyway, I hope you uh, enjoy your Friday and have a great weekend too. Take care. Bye-bye.